In episode four, we're headed to Chester, South Carolina, where Tim Priest with Team Big Racks is hosting a Hunters Alike guest hunt for Matthew Elam. Matt has never shot a deer with his bow, and Riley and Isaac are behind the camera hoping to capture his first bow kill on film. Yeah, so uh, this will be my third, this is my third hunting season, my first season. I, I've kind of always wanted to hunt, and I got into it, luckily, through my girlfriend. Uh, her dad was a lifetime hunter, and uh, only child was a daughter with absolutely no interest in the outdoors. Um, so once he found out I was going to kind of stick around, he kind of took me under his wing, and uh, that first year I got one with my rifle, um, just a little, you know, basket rack seven, but kind of got fully addicted at that point, um, went and bought my bow uh, the spring after that, and uh, kind of found my passion in archery and bow hunting in general. Um, I've worked up to the point where I work, I uh, shoot in an archery league one time a, a week, and I'm um, planning on doing some more tournaments in the upcoming year and stuff, so um, I kind of really got into, really liked the, the hunting thing, because uh, I'm really big into cooking and eating, and I like, you know, kind of being involved with the whole process. You know, uh, Katie's dad doesn't use a processor at all, and we have all our home butchering equipment, so I've done that with him on a couple deer he's killed. Um, st hunted all last year with my bow, um, had a couple close calls, but didn't get anything, so I'm ready to put something in the freezer with my bow for sure. They put a, a, a bend in the bridge to try to separate vibration and it goes now. Uh -huh. And it does a little bit. It's nothing crazy though. Yeah. Is this a 31? Or yeah, 31. Yeah. It's actually 31 and a half because of the, uh, they don't say it, but it's yeah. 31 and a half because of the prevent lungs. Okay. Pass parallel. All right. So after a nice morning of hunting, we came up here to Nickel Store, which is a really cool like whole operation up here. They have everything from a warehouse. They do their own processing here. And then they've got a little restaurant in there, so we ate, and then it's just wandered around their, their awesome little shop in there. They got an archery pro shop, you know, virtual archery, everything in there. Um, definitely gonna be coming back here. Um, so now we're all full, and we're gonna go you know, check out the property a little bit more, and try to make a game plan, and try to, you know, uh, actually get something done this afternoon.
getting back to the truck, you know, it's about 7.20. Uh, we sat pretty much to the last bit of light, uh, changed that stand up a little bit. Uh, didn't really see much of anything, but, you know, it's just how it goes sometimes. Uh, got out here, had some good time in the woods, and then made some new friends, so I definitely don't chalk the day up to a loss at all. I'd like to thank Tim with Team Big Racks for being kind enough to host us both this morning, and uh, of course thank Hunters Alike. Well guys, I guess this is it. Thanks for everything. Yeah man, it was nice to meet you. Yeah, you too. Appreciate it. Take care, have a safe trip back. We'll all keep in touch, you know, yep. this was fun. Thanks bud. Oh man, thank you. Absolutely. I'm so proud of him. And when I do eventually get one, I'll send you a picture. Okay, yeah, man. It might even be with us. Yeah, yeah. we'll see. It might <laughs> even be Absolutely. with us. Yeah, we'll, we'll keep it going. And we talked about a little bit about everything. That was my Yeah, we did. Thanks, guys. Man, yeah, have a thanks, good man. one. Take Stay care. in touch, dude. Bye bye. We'll do.